Going through the farm, just me and my gator. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we're back. Farm Simulator 2019, baby. Woo, ha, ha, just hanging out here. Excuse me. Gotta get some more agua. Because we got a lot of animals to do. Uh, not to do, not to do, not to do. That's gross. No, 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 no. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Strike that. Reverse it. We have a lot of animals we gotta take care of today. So, our chicken coop is looking... Cooptastic. <laughs> so, the small chicken coop holds about 100 uh, chickens. The large chicken coop holds 400 chickens. So, if you have 100 uh, chickens, uh, all they really need is wheat. It's not the, the best yield. Yeah. So, it's very deceiving when these eggs, you see like, oh my god, $3,000. Oh my god, $3,500. Like, well, this is amazing. This is the most amazing thing ever. $3,500 for how much? Just for $1,000. But... Each box. Let's see if I can even get this out of here. Can I even do it? Are we stuck? Come on, man. This thing is a gator. You can't get out of the swamp. Let's go there, tiger. There we go. Oh, he's pushing it. Ah, it's pushing it. So, I've set up an automated uh, system here for the conveyor belt so that we don't have to constantly worry about taking a shovel or taking a, uh, a shovel, a uh, front end loader. And I'm definitely not taking this up any hills. Not today, sir. So I'll tell you what, we'll leave this for a tractor. We just need it for our sheepies. Now our sheepies are looking strong right now. I'm not sure of the capacity of the uh, small pen, but in the top field here, we bought field 18. I put the sheep fam up there, and then that's that's what we're getting after, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we got our silage over here. He's uh, just making money. Money making, making money. Money making. The problem though with, whoops. Wrong button. Uh, also, sorry today if you hear any extra clicking. I uh, my normal keyboard, uh, the D, surprisingly, ironically, double D diesel designs, the D key broke off. I think I can replace it. I think I can. Let's turn this off. But look at all these boxes of eggs. Yeah, so the D key. So I had to replace my keyboard, and it's. Uh, can be loud so each one of these holds 150 eggs so if you grab an entire uh, row or or what have you uh, I'm not quite sure what this entire thing is going to fill up I don't know what's gonna give us but we're gonna take the gate and we're gonna rock and roll it now as you can see this thing is just pouring and pouring and pouring so now if we just want to clean it it's it's automated but not really so it it'll work without you actually in the conveyor belt but there are times where it builds up a smidge, a tad, a hint, and then you just gotta hop in there and then it automatically just sucks everything out and then puts it back into here so you don't have to constantly worry about feeding your chickens. And all you eat is wheat and barley. So all you need to do is just make one field. Uh, 4,000 or 5,000 wheat is pretty decent. And then you set up this automated system with just this conveyor belt and then you gotta finagle it a little bit, a smidge, a hint. And then get it in there, and you're pretty good. I've been rolling for about five or six days in game. Just doing our thing. Chicken wing. You know what I'm saying? This is the first one. Hello? We're going to load these in here. We're going to stack them all kinds of nice. Let's try to. <laughs> Ugh. Uh, uh, Let's see how high we can make this. Let's see how dumb we can make it do. <clears throat> nice. Finally, last box. Now I know what you're thinking. I probably loaded this down with too much eggs. I don't know the exact amount we're gonna get. I don't know exactly how much money we're gonna get for our trailer load. Uh, can I? Oh. <laughs> it's held on there by with a ribbon and a dream, baby. Let's go. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. And because we load things on top in the back of this thing, it uh, the camera angles get really funky. So let's see how much money we can make. Let's see which one is the winner, my friends. Central Grain Elevator. The restaurant's actually pretty high up there, but there's five extra five hundred dollars for it. Where is the Central Grain Elevator? sawmill oh okay that's not that far I mean yeah it is kind of far but you know what it's an adventure 
for an extra five hundred dollars, I think we'll make the trip. Let's, let's go. Oh God. Yeah, that that top one's definitely not definitely not ratcheted down there a bit. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to take this. Hold on, everyone. Beacon. I can't. I'm gonna have to like. Can I zoom out and go behind it? I can. Okay. Woo. Kind of. Kind of. Help. Woo, that, that that camera angle is whack. That is a whack camera angle. Okay. So, let's see here. I'll tell you what. Let's see if I can move this. There. Up top here. Then latch it on. That's what's up. And that's what's up. Go into the market, ladies and gentlemen. Just me and my eggs. Just me and my eggs. Ah, what a nice Sunday drive. Nice leisurely Sunday drive here here on the farm. Very good. I'm enjoying the, the fact that we're uh, moving along here, getting the, the farm up to snuff, up to toe. Uh, there are a couple of uh, maps, like Estancia La Pacho has come out. Uh, I'm kind of interested in doing a little, like a little mini series, or a little mini series, uh, of doing uh, just farming simulator mods. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Also, someone has written in the comments about the cotton and how it grows back. In real life, you are right. In the game, because there's some finagling that has to go on, uh, it needs to be seeded every single time you harvest. I read that from the dev blog. Unless that's incorrect. But I did sit there for about four or five in-game days just to see, like, if the cotton would grow back, and it never, ever did. So, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below. Hook a brother up, man. Hey, man. All right here. How much money are we gonna get? I don't know because I can't see because the camera angle suck. There we go. And then we unlatch. Okay. It's weird that we th we're throwing eggs down here. Uh, okay. I'll tell you what. Can I get in here? Let's... Boom. So each case gives you $527, man. Well, at least here, anyway. At this particular moment in... Whoops, I grabbed on... <laughs> grabbed onto the car. We're super strong, remember? We've been eating our Wheaties. Hold on. Let's move this forward. Nice, man. Hold on. Take the eggs! Nice. Nice. That's like super duper nice. So, what we'll do here, since we're all the way up here, let's just reset it. Okay, we'll use some magic. Okay, it's gonna be fine. We'll fill it up with some... We'll, we'll take the hit. Yeah, and I'm, I got... I got a front-end loader thinking I was going to have to uh, do some things when it comes to cleaning all of our pens. Now, you can do it the uh, normal average way just by going and get a uh, tractor with a front-end loader and a shovel. And then you can just go ahead and sweep it all, all, uh, sweep out the uh, feed area. It's basically the sheeps and chickens. They have very poor manners. So, grass goes all over the place. Wheat goes all over the place. And that's why we have the conveyor belts to pick all that up. We pick them up and put them down back into the feeder so that it just kind of recycles it again. And you don't have to constantly go over it with a tractor if we're going off-road. This is what it's meant to do. Woo! Look at all that wool, baby! Woo! Let's check it out. Check, to check, 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 to check it out. What, 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 what's it all about? Mm-mm. So... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It's fantastic. But 
The prices. I've never seen them so low. Now, someone also um, said in the uh, comment section, "Is like, well, it's a supply and demand kind of thing. I, I, I got it. But if the price is, like, the, the demand has to be going on somewhere. Just because I have the supply doesn't mean that the demand should be cut short, I think. Like, that's just, it seems silly. So check this out. We got our conveyor belt. And because there's a leveling, our, our field leveling, it's not, it's just, the, the, the tool is just not great. But this was the only way it would be uh, allowed for me to drop this in here. It's not the best. Shape Ace. Shape Ace. Marr. Marr. So in total, how many do we have in here? I, just, I, I went a little ham. So 12, 15, 14, 15, so 30, uh, 44. 56. 56 sheep. Boom. And that's math. Uh, we have 100 chickens in the chicken coop. They're all right, though. Uh, cleanliness is next to godliness. But here we are dirty. Let's see if I can kind of maneuver this a bit here. Uh, right. Oh. I, gotta, I have to start the conveyor belt's engine first. Can you believe it? Okay, so let's move that out a bit. A smidge, a tad. The problem here is... Is that their feeder? It looks like it's. It looks like it's full. It looks like it's full. F1. Turn off the belt. There we go. I think it's really about as good as we're gonna get. I really, really do. Um, yeah. So, it's supposed to pick up the grass. Grass goes into here, shoots it all over here, and then right back into the feeder, making sure that our sheep stay nice, high and tight, dry. Always fed dry. Well, they're not always, they're not always dry. I can't, I can't do anything about that. But, that's how we have it going here. It looks awful. It really does. But at the moment, that's what I had to work with, and uh, I wanted to see if it'll work. Um, I, I have a feeling that it might work a little bit better if I had two of them. So if you have two of those going into one of these, and then that way you can set them up on both sides, and then you kind of lay this lengthwise. But I have this weird setup here because of the angle of the uh, of the, the terrain here. And uh, I also don't know what to plan on this field. I'm thinking about just maybe putting in some more grass in here because they also require uh, grass or hay. Am I right, sheep? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, my man. What's going on, brown sheep? How are you? That's actually them stuttering in game. It's not. That's not my frames or anything like that. That's actually how they move. It looks like they're made out of paper mache. Mm. -hmm. So we're gonna give it a little. We're gonna give it a little wait to be sure of a. Uh, I want, I want a decent price. I want top tier price. Because we kind of slacked off. I don't want to say slacked off, but our, when we were selling our, our cotton over there, our cotton, I mean, we just, we settled. That's what, I don't want to settle. That's the word I'm looking for. I don't want to settle for a decent price. I want top tier price for wool because wool will bring in the moolah. Each one of these has 4,000. So each sack is 1,000. Boom, 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 boom. So if you, I've seen it go all the way up to about $2,000 in cotton. I'm cotton wool. <clears throat> so I've seen this get up to 2K. So each little tiny sack will be $2,000. Now, I'm not saying I need to have $2,000, but I definitely want to wait for it to be blue. If I was green, I would die. If I were the... Blah, 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 I don't know the lyrics. So I don't think anybody else does either. What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. It's like, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm done, right? No. No, man. No, you are not done. What are you doing over here? You're killing me, Smalls. You are killing me. Finish the rest of your job. We could probably sell some of them soybeans right now, man. Okay, everything's good over here. It's like, <laughs> it's like final check, final check. 
Um, let's go ahead. We'll drop this. And I'm thinking maybe we can probably snag up some money for some soybeans. Just try to get us over 200k. I think that would be lovely. This is an absolute nightmare. This is this is a grass nightmare. We've gotta gotta organize this a bit. I hate how it, I hate how it just goes loosey goosey all over the place and just doesn't. When you hire a worker, the hi the worker ends at a certain area, but yet the mower seems to keep on uh, trucking. Look at this! Look at this mess! Look at this mess! I'm working on it, kids. I'm working on it. Don't don't you worry. Do not fret, my pet. Our ponies are doing just fine. Got a new batch. Oh my god! Oh my god! Come on. Doesn't seem to matter where I go now. It's going to be two rows, which is fine. It's fine. So we'll take our loading wagon. Uh, not our loading wagon. We're going to we're gonna bail this stuff up here as well. Get a little extra cash. That'll be off camera because, I mean, how many times are you going to see me bail some ba ba bail and bail some silage, baby? Making all kinds of cash. That's where you make the money, baby. That's where you make the money. It's all in the silage. Ponies, they're nice. I'm telling you, man, we need a treadmill. If I could just put those those horses on a treadmill, we would be a-ok, -okay, man. We would be uh, we would be in the green. Chicken wing, no saying. So let's go ahead and lift that up. I'll tell you what, we're going to drop this. We really need to get a shed, though. That is that's priority number two on the list. Oh, also we put the fuel tank over here. Hold on, let's go over the trench, the, the World War One trench. All right. Woo, we are a little low on gas. Woo! Time for a demonstration. So, this is our mod. A little fuel tank here. Diesel fuel. What's up? That's what's up. It's $5,000. Boom, plant it right, on, right, there, right there in your crib. Got it right next to our repair station, too. Which we've already done on this jam right here, man. Mm-hmm. So, what we're going to do is we're going to grab some soybeans. I think I have a bunch of soybeans. Yeah, I got a gaggle. A herd. A murder. A murder of soy. 13,000? What, what do we got going for? 1,630 at the ranch. Well, that's close by. Sitting in my ranch. Oh, we got a box. We already got a brand new box of eggs. Legs and eggs, baby. Legs and eggs. If you ever go to a strip club. Sometimes they have a breakfast buffet. Usually it's always called legs and eggs. How do I know that? Mind your own business. For one. Two. It's good to uh, learn something here on a Sunday. Okay. Okay. Y'all think I can make it through the trail with this? Let's go trail hopping? Why not? Let's do it. I'm up for an adventure. Ranch is right at the top of this. Right at the top. As long as you don't see any mountain lines, we'll be, we'll be all, all set. Oh, okay, hold on. Make sure we've got the beacons on so that we people know in case in case they see us, they know we mean business. I think we'll be I think we'll be just fine. Nice little shortcut. Nice little range. Nice little mountain range. So, it's interesting because the eggs I thought the eggs weren't gonna give us a whole lot. And it didn't really. But if you just let it run and just let it run all the way out and make sure that it uh, that the eggs fill up uh, your entire loading area there in the chicken coop, you know, you're looking at a good like Anywhere between, I think it was like 10 to 20k, something like that. So it's not going to be something where you're going to be like no, like looking, looking all the time. But when you head on over and you feed the chickens, which if you set up the uh, system that I have going on right now, or even uh, like the Lely uh, Juno mod, uh, that little uh, R2D2 unit, uh, I'm not sure if the mod creator is going to be uh, putting that out. I would really like it if he did. He or she would put that out because it was so clutch. Uh, until those come out, this is the system I'm going to be rocking. Uh, don't want to shovel up anything. Don't want to use a front-end loader. Don't want to scoop things up. It's too time-consuming. My time is valuable, guys. Okay. Okay. So we got a full load here, 14,000. Giggity. And... Where's the ranch at? Oh, it's right there. Haha. <laughs> All right. Now traffic, uh, like I was mentioning before in a previous video, the traffic is on. Just 
there ain't a whole lot of traffic going on. There's no, not a whole lot of traffic going on. Oh. Hmm. It also looks like there's like a little race trail. There's flags up somewhere here. So we may have to get our finest horse. We may have to breed our finest horse. And do what we can. Alright, let's get ourselves over 200k, baby. Let's just do this. Oh, yeah. So, uh, let me know in the comment section down below what you think about a mod review. I think we're going to give it a try. I'm going to see, uh, see how I like it. I kind of want to do like its own my own separate map. I don't want to do the mod review reviews or mod reviews not really mod reviews just like checking out like hey look at this twenty two thousand dollars that's all right that's all right uh but we'll start a new map maybe a stancia la Pacho. or we'll check out the uh we'll, we'll, our, our modded world will possibly be the fruit of hair the fruit of hair the other uh the other map is on here the firm curve i forget what the name is but it's pretty and i would like to see what I could do with it. Um, but yeah, that's going to be our... I have a feeling we're going to have a little modded area there. That's where I'm just going to... Just fart in a bunch of money. And a bunch of time. And check out some new mods that come out every single week. Every single day, there's a new mod that comes out. And it's fantastic. Some people think it's cheating. And I get it. And I understand. But at the same time, I enjoy mods. That's how I like to play my game. That's how I enjoy to play the game. And that's the name of the game. So we'll get a bunch of mods in there and check it out. And uh, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Also, happy Sunday. Hope everyone had a happy, uh, fantastic weekend. I'm still recovering from Thanksgiving. I'm a mess. <laughs> Got a stuff. Had a show last night. Just carried over the Thanksgiving feeling. Today, head hurts. But you know what? I'm, ri I'm rip ripped, ready, and raring. A football, baby. Woo! Let's go Buccaneers, baby. Woo! Why do you love... Buccaneers, what? Huh? Don't you live in Pennsylvania? Yeah. Yeah, I do. And Eagles fans are gross. Love you, Eagle fans. But you know what I'm talking about. You can... You can be... You can be a little tedious. A little tedious. A little, uh... I gotta go stand away from this guy. He is going off the wall. Like Chris Brown. But not like it that way with Chris Brown. I'm talking about the song. You know what I'm saying. The song. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. But it's a nice soothing day. And we got our chickens. And we got our sheeps. And we got our hoes. <laughs> our hoes? No, excuse me. Excuse me. Horses. Horses, of course, of course. So what's the not the last thing, obviously, is going to be the moo cows. We need some moo cows in here, man. Got a cow pasture. A small one. Oh, my God. 300,000. Oh yeah, this looks like uh, it's definitely something that's not going to fit anywhere in this entire map. Look at this. Look at this nonsense. <laughs> it's like, come on, man. You're killing me, Smalls. It's like, you don't own this land. Okay, okay. <clears throat> what about this land? It would be so nice if I could just rotate this. And have it work. Let's do it again. Oh, oh. See, it looks like it wants to go. It gives me a price for it. And then it's like, nah. Nah, son. Alright, let's see if I can finagle this. Ugh, it's such a pain in the ass. Huh? Uh, 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 uh. You know what? Speaking of mods, <laughs> I'm going I really, I really don't want to do this to you, sir. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Silos is in the silo section. Is not sheds. There we go. Is there any way I can just? You do not have enough money. Enough money for what? What kind of money are you throwing at me? So, this is a leveling mod that I've not tried, but it looks like looks like now I can't purchase any animal farms. Good thing I made all that money. 
<laughs> I can't even sit this on top of there. Uh, it was all for naught. It was all for naught. Great. Good. Good. Oh, we can put it in the middle of a <laughs> cotton field. I'll tell you what. We'll figure out some place for it. Um, it may be in the center here. <laughs> I think I could purchase this land. I mean, not now, but <laughs> eventually. And how much is this? $202,000. That's what I should have spent my money on. That's what I should have. <clears throat> should have done. Sorry about the extra clicking. Sorry about the loud clicking. What is with this? It's like a haze. Y'all see that? What is that? Huh? What? That is so weird. It's a phantom. It's a ghost chicken's run. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button, help out my channel ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos coming out every single day, every single week. Gotta get it all. Gotta scoop it up for the chickens. Boom. Haha. -ha. Everyone, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like you all. And I will check you out right here again. Farm Simulator 2019, baby. Woo! Ha ha! Next time. So, so, much, so many things to do. Stupid land, stupid land leveler, stupid, stupid things. Well, I mean, it's level now, so got that going for us. Whatever we're going to put on there. Hmm. Decisions. Decisions. Decisions.